All right, taste and flavor, these are two different things. And I saw this caused a lot of confusion when I used to lecture on the flavor of food. People use taste and flavor like they're synonyms, but they're definitely not. because I think that is the more obvious of the two because you probably learned about your sense of taste when you were a child. And if I were to define our sense of taste, it would be something like taste is your response when a molecule in the food you're eating interacts with the receptor in your taste bud. So it's something in the food interacts with your taste bud and elicits a response. And we can call these responses sweet, sour, salty, umami, and bitter. We have five basic tastes. And so these tastes, these five basic tastes, um, are of course very important when eating food. Maybe you prefer sweet foods compared to salty foods. We all have our preferences. But when you're eating food, you probably know that taste is not the only important factor. And that's where flavor comes in, because flavor is the term that describes all the inputs, whether they're chemical or physical, any input you experience when eating food. So of course, this does include taste, but more importantly, flavor also includes the smell or the aroma of food, as well as a couple other smaller factors, things like the texture of the food. Does the food have um, an appealing color or an unappealing color? As well as your prior experiences of eating the food. Do you have good memories or bad memories of this food? So flavor includes all these different factors, only one of which is taste. And if I had to pick one factor that is probably most important for the flavor of food, it would be our sense of smell or the aroma of the food, definitely not taste. We are much more sensitive to smell than we are to the taste of a food. And you probably know this if you've ever gotten sick and you just don't find food as delicious or as filling or you're not even getting hungry, it's because your nose is probably clogged and backed up and you don't get that nice aroma of food anymore. And of course, if you want to experience how important smell is to eating food and our experience of eating, you can do the quick experiment of plugging your nose and then eating the food and you will realize just how important aroma is to us enjoying food. So taste and flavor, pretty different, right? I mean, taste is pretty simple. It's just molecules in the food that sort of trigger our taste buds, where flavor encompasses all these different things, including taste, but also the smell of the food, what color the food is, texture, mouthfeel, and even things like your memories of eating that food. So flavor is super complex, but really interesting. And probably I should do a couple more videos on flavor of foods. So if you have any questions about flavor, please leave them below or any ideas of videos I should do next. Otherwise, I will talk to you next time. Bye.